Hi everybody, welcome back. Today we're talking about flattering fall 2022 fashion trends that look amazing on women over 50. I had so much fun with my fall fashion trends and then my fall fashion accessory trends for 2022. I wanted to do this video to show you how we can make some of the trends work for us so that we look fabulous over 50. I'm gonna show as many of the looks as possible on myself but I have placed a bunch of orders for fall clothing and everything is delayed. So you just gotta bear with me, ladies. If I can't model it, I will show a photo. So the first fall fashion trend that I think it will look fabulous on all women over 50 is a moto jacket. A moto jacket can really amp up an outfit or you can just wear it really casual. In my opinion, moto jackets never go out of style. There are a variety of leather, vegan, and other fabric choices that you can find in moto jackets today. I bought this one at Athleta. I really like this moto jacket and it is available in sizes extra extra small right up to a 3x. I love that it is washable. It is made from recycled polyester, organic cotton, and spandex. I can see myself wearing this moto jacket all throughout the fall and probably into early December. I plan on wearing it when I go for my walks outdoors once it gets cool enough to wear a jacket. I can also pair it with jeans and if I needed to, a pair of dress pants. So I went with the black and I'm going to dress it up with different scarves and that's what I usually do. I don't follow the trends too much, but I might, you know, add a pop of color here and there. But for my clothes, I try to always go with a classic look. The second fashion trend for 2022 that I think that will look fabulous on women over 50, particularly us petite women over 50 that have a little apple body shape going on, and they are wide leg pants. The thing about the wide leg pants is that it is going to make us look taller. I'm not talking about bell bottom pants. I would look horrible in them and I have no interest in them. But as you can see, the jeans that I am showing in this outfit they are by NYDJ, Not Your Daughter's Jeans. They are very, very comfortable. And I actually size down and they really hold everything in. I did have to get about six inches taken off, of course, to shorten them for my inseam. But I'm really pleased with them. And I think that they're a great pair of jeans to take me right through fall. The third fashion trend that I think any woman over 50 can rock are statement loafers. Loafers are so versatile. Again, they can be worn casual or with dress pants. I have been on the hunt for a classic pair of black statement loafers. I've ordered three pairs so far and I've had to send all three back and I was hoping to have my next pair in before this video filmed, but unfortunately I can only show you a photo. They're only gonna show up next week. But I really like the clean classic look of the Sam Edelman loafers. I like also that they're kind of masculine looking because I think that is a nice look to sometimes go against like more feminine touches in an outfit. And I like the, uh, the horse bit that goes across. I think that's what you call it. The thing that goes in their mouth. Sorry that I can't model them, but I will show you a pair that I picked up last year in the animal print. Absolutely love them, love loafers, and I think that they're a great staple to have in any wardrobe. So I think the next fall fashion trend that we can incorporate into our wardrobe, our top handle purse. Remember in the fall accessory video, we talked about hobo bag style and how that is really popular this fall. I'm kind of taking the trend, but I'm kind of tweaking it. I'm going with a top handle purse. And as you can see, this Michael Kors purse that I'm carrying is a really nice, I think, classic look for a purse, but I'm using the top handles to fit into the fall 2022 fashion trend. Personally, I don't like a hobo bag, but I know some of you do and that's great. If you can make a hobo bag work for you, um, you know, go for it. Then you're going to be trendy in 2022. For those of us that don't like a hobo bag, if you have a bag that has top handles, that is on trend. So that's one way that we can be trendy for the fall. The next fashion trend that we can incorporate into our wardrobe this fall is a white t-shirt. The white tank top is what is on trend in fall, but I'm just adding the white t-shirt because I don't want to wear a tank top 
in the fall, but I think a white t-shirt by itself with a nice statement necklace or under a sweater or a blazer or even my moto jacket will look really stylish and that'll make me look trendy. Remember one of the trends was baggy clothes and we all agreed who looks good in baggy clothes. So I'm tweaking baggy clothes to comfy clothes. They don't have to be baggy, but we can still be comfortable. We don't have to look frumpy, but we can look comfy in our comfy clothes. As you can see the outfit that I'm showing, I have my Zella live-in jogger pants that I absolutely love. They come in all different sizes. They might even have petite lengths. I wear an XXL in just the regular length and they fit me fine. I'm 5'4". So I think my joggers paired with my moto jacket, that is a baggy look. I don't look baggy, I just look comfortable and put together. I really like this next trend and I wish that I could wear them, but I just don't have anywhere to go. I'm talking about a maxi dress or a maxi skirt. I think paired with a nice pair of booties or even statement loafers with a nice jean jacket or a moto jacket, that would really be a nice looking outfit for the fall. Unfortunately, it gets really chilly here and I don't feel like wearing a dress and I'm not going anywhere that requires a dress, but if you live in a warmer climate, you know, one way to be on trend is wearing either a maxi skirt or a maxi dress. And the nice thing about a maxi skirt or a maxi dress, especially a maxi dress, it's all like one length. So if you're petite, it's going to make you look longer and leaner. And I think that would be a really nice look for fall. So I've taken the chunky boot trend. Do you remember they had the over the knee boots and they were really big and clunky? I think that a nice pair of boots paired with jeans or leggings would be really, really nice for fall. Put on a nice sweater, a scarf. You're gonna look really, really great for a fall outing. I have on my list, I wanna get a pair of Bluntstone Chelsea boots. I do have the boots that I'm showing, but they're more of a winter boot and they're from UGG. I don't think that they're available any longer, but I will try and find something similar. And the last fall fashion accessory trend that I think we can all embrace is a fuzzy accessory. I'm not talking about wearing a fuzzy sweater or fuzzy pants or fuzzy boots. How about this really cute fuzzy bucket hat that I bought from Amazon last year? I wore this hat every day last winter. It kept my head so warm. I never used to be a hat person, but for some reason I wanted a bucket hat and bucket hats are still all the rage right now. It is so versatile, it's cute, it's a lot of fun, plus it's practical if you live in a cool climate. So you might wanna check out the bucket hats and I will link a bunch below. So let me know what you think about the fashion trends that I think would be very flattering for us women over 50. And if you have any suggestions, be sure to share them in the suggestion box. Go check out my two fall 2022 fashion trend videos and hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.